Archaea are a diverse group of single-celled microorganisms that are distinct from bacteria and eukaryotes. They often thrive in extreme environments, though they can be found in a wide range of habitats. Here are 10 types of archaea, each representing different genera or groups with unique characteristics. Halobacterium. These are halophilic, salt-loving archaea that thrive in extremely salty environments, such as salt lakes and salt mines. Methanogens, methanobacterium. Methanogens are archaea that produce methane as a byproduct of their metabolism. They are found in anaerobic environments like wetlands, ruminant guts, and sewage treatment plants. Thermoplasma. These archaea are thermoacidophiles, meaning they thrive in hot, acidic environments. They lack a cell wall and can be found in hot springs and acidic coal refuse piles. Pyrococcus. Hyperthermophilic archaea that thrive in extremely hot environments, such as hydrothermal vents. They grow optimally at temperatures around 100 degrees Celsius, 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Sulfolobus. Another group of thermoacidophiles, sulfolobus species, are found in hot, acidic environments like sulfuric hot springs. They are known for oxidizing sulfur to derive energy. Nanoarchaeum equitans. This archaea is notable for being one of the smallest known living organisms and exists as an obligate symbiont with another archaeon, Ignococcus. They are found in hydrothermal vent environments. Nitrosopumilus meridimus. This archaeon plays a crucial role in the nitrogen cycle by oxidizing ammonia to nitrite. It is found in marine environments and is part of the Thaumarchaeota phylum. Acidulae profundum. These acidophilic archaea are found in deep sea hydrothermal vents and are known for thriving in acidic, high pressure environments. Methanopyrus. This genus includes hyperthermophilic methanogens that thrive at temperatures above 100 degrees Celsius, 212 degrees Fahrenheit, and are found in hydrothermal vent systems. Ignococcus. These archaea are hyperthermophiles found in deep sea hydrothermal vents. They have a unique outer membrane and often form a symbiotic relationship with nanoarchaeum equitans.